guys, it's Ty. It's Christmas. Actually, it's Christmas night. It's like 5 o'clock. And, um, Merry Christmas to everybody. I hope everybody had a great day. Um, I just wanted to talk to you guys about a few things. And not to just brag about everything I got or whatever. But, um, I got a couple really cool th things that really just were very thoughtful and I wanted to share it with you. Um, I got some lighting to make my videos better quality so I can make a video like any time, day or night. Like I always struggled, like I had to do it during the day and at a certain time where there's not, you know, where it's bright enough or, um, and I got, um, a uh, microphone for my camera with this little raccoony tail thing that goes over it so you can actually um, go outside in the wind and it'll cut the sound of the wind whipping through so that was really thoughtful and Ben got me this watch it's called a move sports watch and it's for tracking your athletic endeavors like uh, running, weightlifting, swimming, whatever you do, uh, biking, and it'll give you tips on um, how to um, improve your stroke if you're swimming or, or, you know, it'll just track how many steps you, I don't know. I don't even know the whole app yet. I haven't looked at it, but it does a lot of stuff. But what I'm most excited about is that it, it's waterproof and, it, and it's for swimming. And so I can't wait to use it on Tuesday. So, uh, yeah, that was an awesome gift. Thanks, Ben. But the next thing I want to talk about, since we're talking about swimming, is that I actually swim five days a week. So I'm in the locker room with a bunch of guys, and everybody's naked, walking around, and I have this little routine where I'm in the shower, and I have to dry off in the shower stall, put my underwear on, and put a towel around me, and walk out. Well, I'm no Buck Angel. Buck Angel will walk out in the locker room. He doesn't care, but he's also a lot bigger and a lot stronger than I am. And so I would get my little tiny booty kicked. So what my wife did was she went to this place called Transthetics. Uh, it's at transthetics.com out of Australia. And she bought me this device called the Rod. And it's a little pricey. It costs $200. But it's well worth it. And here's what it looks like in my pants. I'll stand up for a second. Okay, so then there, there it is. Just kind of sitting there in my pants. You know, whatever. So, um, and then basically this is what it looks like. Okay, so you can film back up here. Take it off. Oh, did you hear that? <laughs> yeah. Um, anyway, so uh, this is it. And it comes in a few shades of colors. Uh, you usually try to get it darker than your skin color because that's what a uh, cis man's penis looks like. And you, to, believe it or not, um, cis man's flaccid penis is about three inches. And that's what this is. So uh, this is to put onto your growth and it'll actually suck onto you if you're on um, testosterone and you have the bottom growth there. And uh, it's also good for if you have a metoidioplasty with urethral lengthening and you can't quite um, reach over your zipper or your, or your pants to stand a pee. This helps in, in that area also. And um, you can also use this according to, you know, the guy who we got this from. If you're a cis man who, like, has a micro penis and wants to look larger. So, what you do is you flip it inside out like this. And you put it to yourself. You know, not, not your nose, but, you know. And you plaster it to yourself and you let go of it. And it, it just sticks there. And um, this guy is actually, who makes this, is actually an athlete. Like, I think he's a, a mountain climber and a, maybe a bike rider. He might even be a swimmer, but he created this. And um, 
I think it works so far so good. It's not something that I will wear every day, but like I said, just in those situations where uh, I need to uh, feel more comfortable and I don't want to be, you know, singled out as the weird guy who wears underwear out of the shower, I'll be wearing this. So, yeah. Okay, so all of you who thought that was a little bit TMI, I'm sorry, but I just wanted to share. I'm an open book. You all know me by now. So not to just talk about me getting presents, but Sandy uh, and Ben pretty much got everything that they asked for. Um, Sandy's really hard to shop for, but she was happy and Ben was spoiled like he always is, but um, he got what he wanted. Right, Ben? Yes. Okay. I guess that means he got what he wanted. He, this really cool thing that he got, though, uh, this virtual reality thing that you wear and it's like so cool I mean I had to try it and I will do it again and again I'm sure but yeah this, this, this is what it looks like real funny okay so I guess I will see you guys at the end of the year all right bye We don't usually throw around $200 um, devices. It's precious.